Hey, folks, Quilly King here, and welcome to another episode of Let... <sighs> I hate it when the person who's, there we go, who's supposed to lock things in is asleep, and we're, we're timing down, <laughs> and someone moves, so it resets the counter. Uh, something, something, let's play Dota Auto Chess. Uh, we had a really bad game last time. Hopefully we can do better this time. I will start with the Tusk, just because there's like... Activating the Beast Synergy early is so good... Well, this is friendly. That I, you know, that's one of the things I like about you know, you know, the internet. It really brings the best of humanity together. <laughs> uh, I, I'm gonna have to put some sort of warning on this video. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so we're, we're gonna try to play well this time. I mean, I guess I try to play well every time, and it doesn't work. So maybe I should just try to play badly this time. Uh, I'll do the, like, the George Costanza thing. Whatever I think is the correct move, I'll just do the opposite, and then somehow everything will work out all of a sudden. Uh, maybe that maybe that's the path to the future. I don't know. Da -da 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 -da. One of the things I could have done is taken the... Like, I could have locked and taken a couple of... Um, a couple of mechs. So, if we get the Enchantress, I guess what we do... You know, like Furion's a little bit better, but that would be all the money, and then pick up a drow, see what we, see what develops. But hey, look at this—we got B synergy right away. Is is a thing, I guess. I guess what I could do, what I could have done, is sold you and just bought Malfurion instead, and have double druid right away. What the hell is wrong with people? Why why is this? I mean, okay, we'll disable the bullet chat, so at least it doesn't spam the front of our screen, but we'll still see everything over here. One thing, as far as I can tell, there's no way to, like, mute people in this mod. Like, normally you'd open sort of the player list or something like that, um, and then you'd mute people, but... I don't know. Uh, Alright, well, I mean, I don't have the second druid to trigger that. Not really any synergy being built up. That's okay. We'll grab the Chaos Knight. Because um, he's pretty good on his own. And if we can get an Abaddon and a trigger the Undead bonus, that wouldn't be too, too bad. <laughs> oh, the internet. Uh, I could sell those two and pick up the Slaughter or something, but I don't think there's much point. I mean, it would be Warrior Synergy, but we don't know where we're going. Seriously, is there... Is Please tell me if there's a way to turn off, uh, turn off chat or something. Move it, hide it. Mute all incoming chat. Mute all chat from enemies. Technically, they would be friends. The thing is, if I do this, I'll forget to do it later. Here, I, I will do that. Mute all chat. Uh, ooh, we got we got a, a, a fair number of items over here. I'm not sure where they're gonna go right yet, but that's nice to see. But yeah, I'm gonna have to make sure to turn that on for when we go uh, multiplayer. Okay, so I can make the enchantress the hard way. Which I don't think I'm going to do, but we can get a knight here. I guess we just accept the fact that we're going to lose beast synergy anyway. So let's do this. They're two demons, but they're the same demon. Do I want to... Do I want to sell stuff and pick up an extra copy of the Enchantress? Do I want the Anti-Mage? Uh, I could deploy the items, and maybe I sh shoulda here. I think that's gonna miss that guy, because he moved. I'm gonna go and do this. Not sure we're gonna win. Mostly depends on... There we go. And if we're able to, uh, to land those attacks there. I'm not gonna give you the, um... Oof. Yeah, he ulti. Okay. The void, whatever. Um, I, I guess I'm gonna keep this. Okay, at least what we can do is we can put you in so that we can level up the Enchantress and we can always use that as a way to make some money. I definitely, I at least do this. The question is, do I actually level up to five here? And I think the answer is going to be no. I mean, I could sell you and you and go up to five, but I think this is going to be all right. Um... I'll pick these up, just randomly. There's still some possibility that we might do a change. <clears throat> We've got the Knight and Beast Synergy going on right now. 
We don't have any, like, we, we're a little close to a tier two here. And we've got the or two star. We've got the two star enchantress, which is something. I mean, she's never going to be the DPS queen. But her healing's not bad at this point. And then getting the beast synergy going on with Luna is kind of sexy. Cloak Void Stone. Cloak turns into, right, the Hood of Defiance, which is pretty strong if we get the, all the rings. We don't have any rings yet. So do we level up this turn, or what? Oh. Get in there. Move you. So you actually merge. I'm like, why didn't you merge? Um, again, I'm, I guess... Do I keep... I mean, okay, you're gonna get soul. This is a little late for me to actually do the level here. So I'm really delaying going up to five. On the other hand, that is going to give us a couple more cracks at some one stars than we would normally. The two star chances really change. It's slowing down our three. But the thing is, this actually might help us get an early three-star Enchantress, which isn't so terrible. And we got to win anyway, so... But, like, I totally knew we were going to win, you guys, so it was totally fine. Um, yeah, odds of getting Chaos Knight don't really change. And there we go. See if we can... Um, oh, I guess we still need one more, don't we? Sell you... Lycan as a beast would be better than Tusk. Okay, we'll, we'll level up here. Um, I think I'll just put in another Chaos Knight. Or you, I could swap out the Tusk now. Well, it's a little late. <clears throat> but yeah, if we've got the Lycan, we don't need the Tusk. I mean, unless we're looking for any kind of warrior synergy, but not really. Yeah, I think we sell the Tusk. Play Lycan with Enchantress. Beast Synergy is very strong, so we clearly want it. I mean, we could go for Quad Beasts. What would be the next beast? Uh, would probably be Venomancer? Right? And Lone Druid? I mean, that's... maybe. Oh. Okay, turn off the bullet. Oh, I want to see the upgrades. But I don't want to see the chat. Which is... this? This is weird. Okay, Timber's pretty good, but I, I don't think we actually need to go for the Timber here. Slaughter for some warrior stuff. Okay, let's turn this off after all. That is very, 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 very distracting. I think we sell the Furion. Just to go up in gold. Actually, no. What I should have done is sold both Tusks. And then put someone else in. If we happen to win, I'll just sell the uh, the Drow. I mean, Undead combo is still good, but... We're not going to win. Yeah, I'll sell you. We still have a, a, a spare Druid around, so if we get our one Enchantress, we can go and make our level 3. And then we can sell you. So, wait, there is the Beast. There's another Luna. I think I have to do a re- Oh, fucking hell! God damn it, Chaos Knight. I was tunnel visioned a little too much. Okay. I'm like, at this point I have so many pairs, I have to go and reroll to like finish one of these. Actually, we can get 4B Synergy now, although I don't think I'd pull anything out. Wrecked my economy and missed the Chaos Knight. 10 out of 10 there, Quill. 10 out of 10. Uh, you are a knight, and we may as well spend the money. Still don't know where the Voidstone goes. Nowhere yet. Could go on the Omni. Although, you're going to mostly trigger your ability by being attacked rather than attacking, so no. There we go. Another kill there. Actually, you're... Oh, you're, you're getting the healing effect from... Um... From Enchantress still. Yeah, it's weird. If she gets off her ability her, and then dies, her, her ult is still active. More Venos. So you pick you up. We're on a losing streak. 
I mean, I could reroll to try to win, but, like, why not? We'll just accept the losing streak here. Um, round 10 mobs. I guess we stay where we are. Well, part of me is, like, move him back a little so he doesn't take the initial brunt of the attack. Oh, wait, we'll give him the cloak. It doesn't matter for this, but he'll be a little less likely to just die from random AoE effects and maybe have a slightly better chance of transforming. Uh, we should go AK here. Good physical damage, like lots of sustain with the beast auto attack. The knight stuff's proccing. Ring of regen. So I guess we'll want to give that to Lycan, because if we get the other ring, he can build the Hooded Defiance. And survive consistently enough to get his wolves off. Okay, well, thank you, game, for taking pity on me and giving me the Chaos Knight. That is much appreciated. And also, we can finish our Enchantress. You can go away. Um, you, you're still going to front line. You're going to go here. You're going to go here. Um, I guess. Okay, and you've got that, so you'll get this. Actually, we're going to want the Venomancer with the Void Stone. Because the, uh, um, the Plague Wards go down pretty fast, and you're just going to be range attack. We want you to spam the shit out of Plague Wards. I guess I guess I could have kept the tree end after all. And level them up. I don't think we're going that route, but I mean it's not like I was gonna have ten gold anyway. So I mean it is after round ten, and we don't have uh, we don't have interest. We didn't power level to six either. Uh, we still lost here, but we've we've actually are building towards something, which is kinda nice. Um I'm really tempted to do some rerolls here. But I guess we'll just accept this. Um let me move you here. Move you up front. Again, I mean, she has exactly the same hit points and same armor as the Chaos Knight, who would think as a frontline person. Like, like, yeah, she's got a range attack, but we may as well leave her on the front. She can heal herself, so I think she's tankier than you might expect. At least next, um, next level, we will level up. We have a little bit of interest. And we've possibly got some, some tech starting to happen. I mean, we're likely going to keep having this losing streak. Ideally, like, if we can if we can lose with just one person on the board over and over, so we lose almost no hit points, but still keep the streak going, uh, we're going to break the streak here. And then we'll probably new lose next round, because that's the way it goes. Do, 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 do. So yeah, not interested in any of these. We'd be very happy for a Veno. Uh, I mean, you're a demon, you're a demon. We could grab extra. I mean, we grab the Lycan, that's for sure. I will throw the Veno in here with this. Let me just give up on the 4 beast synergy idea. What would be the next beast? Lone Druid, I guess. All right, we have three beasts. Give up on the Tusk, maybe. Keep these guys paired. I could do... If I sold you, and you, and one, then we could have 20 gold, but... But not really. So I'll just grab another Chaos Knight here. We are going to win, but I think we keep those. Although, again, if we're willing to sacrifice our economy with all these pairs, then I think the answer becomes very quickly, well, you may as well do a reroll to try to finish off these pairs. I don't know. Like, Lycan, Omni... See, none of these are a thing that we're interested in the slightest. I don't think there's going to be any mage synergy going on in the future. We got a slight win streak. There we go. Like, if we can keep the win streak going, that might be worthwhile. Okay, and, and that that worked out really well. Hitting the like in there, that's huge. Uh, this is another beast. That's true. Let's grab you and see. I don't usually go for four beast synergy, but the game's telling me that maybe we can here. I don't know who we'd pull out. I suppose we have um, we have three knights. I could remove a knight. 
Although, we lose the silence bonus. It's not going to matter for round 15, because it's just... Um, it's wolves, and I think we should be able to do okay, now that I actually remember that it's round 15, and I can reposition. Although, watch me get distracted by buying and then not actually reposition. Thank you. Get in there. Do this. There you go. Someone can jump jump in there. Leave a little assassin pocket. There, we'll make it a little bit bigger. Oh, you might have a hard time uh, summoning your wolves in this position. There we go. We'll give you a little more space. Summon way up to 18. Well, we can probably sell the Chaos Knight. It's hard to, tr to triple up. And then both tusks. There we go. Silencing the wolves doesn't matter, but there you go. Nice ulti there. Couple of plague wards. Quarter staff. Ring of regen. Um, I don't remember if you've got the ring of health or the ring of regen. Quarter staff can probably go on Luna, and if we get a morbid mask, I think is what it's called, to make the mask of madness, then that would be kind of good. Last, uh, not last game, but a previous game, I had two mask of madness on Luna. Um, I don't know if the lifesteal stacks, but there was a hell of a lot of auto attack. So, I, yeah, I, I don't know if that was worth or not. So, no to all of these. And possibly sell someone to go up to 30. Ring regeneration, ring regeneration, yeah. So, I don't think there's much point in putting um, both of those on there. Get in there. But we will go ahead and give you this. One, two, three beasts. I think I'd rather keep the pair of Omni Knights than the chance of going to the fourth beast here. But I want, and I want the economy for sure. I think I'd rather Knights. Maybe get, go to fourth Knight. That would be kind of nice. Um, so we'd be looking at uh, Dragon Knight. Even Dragon Knight without dragons is okay. Um, Necrophos is really good. Here, I'll put a, a ring regen on you, actually. Um, Necrophos is really good, but I'm not sure if it's, like, ruin our economy good. I don't think we need the, like, CM regen stuff. You've got a one-time transform. You d you've got a passive. You've already got plenty of mana. You're going to generate lots from being hit. It's mostly going to be cooldown limited. If we win... If we win, we probably pick up the CM just to see. Because she could help Dragon Knight transform faster. Without, um, without Dragon Synergy. You're also a human. That would give us a third human. Someone who like silences people at range. And then fourth human could be Dragon Knight. And that's quite cool. Look at all these wards that are dropping down. And the wolves. Um, we are actually going to be dealing a lot of damage to whoever we beat. I don't know. Like, can't scroll this, unfortunately. So, that's night number four. But, I gotta pull someone out. So, I actually think I do pull you out for now. And do this. Um... I could pull out a beast, but the thing is, I think the answer is very much no to that. I guess the question is, is it better to get the Knight 4 Synergy? Or sacrifice like a 2 star? Like, we'd be going from a 2 star to a 1 star for the Omni Knight here. We did break human synergy as well. Looks like look like it's fine here, but I actually don't know what the stronger move there would have been. We got some serious deeps between Luna and the thing is I really like Veno with the um, with the Void Stone, Void Shard, or whatever it's called. Um, and ever since they they made his wards give like attack speed debuffs to whoever it hits, Veno's gotten a lot better. B synergy is cool. I mean we're overkilling the B synergy. Um, I don't think it's worth grabbing you. 
I mean, I guess I may as well, just because, you know, I have a couple of points of gold, and we'll see what happens, but it's not a big deal. I guess I'm still okay with the lineup. The, the three-star Enchantress, like, it might be worth doing a swap, even though she's three stars. I don't know, she's twice as many hit points. I don't, we're not really getting hit by assassins, are we? Ooh, big warrior lineup. We are mostly physical DPS. I think, like, this is all... Yeah, slows the attack speed, which is nice. But yeah, we are probably going to lose to the all-warrior lineup here. Since we don't have any real magic DPS. On the other hand... It looks like if you just have enough, like, summons and shit... <laughs> it starts to work out. Okay, I'm really surprised, because I thought that would definitely have our number. Thank you very much for finally finishing the Omni Knight. I feel much better about that. And in fact, I definitely feel good enough to like pull her back here. Uh, we're one sort of XP off from an efficient buying. Um, so we're going to keep the CK. I think that's going to be good. That's not actually where I wanted you. Yeah, not really interested in that stuff. So, we'll level up to 7 next round. Start to get a slightly higher chance for us to see the Dragon Knight, which would be a great addition to our call. Okay, there's an item there, I know. It's another... We can't get a Ring of Health. First of all, the Ring of Health is so much better than the Ring of Regen. Can't get it to save our lives. Staff of Wizardry, I don't know. Could put in the CK, because he does use... He does have his ulti... That used it. Okay, we're gonna level you up, that's for sure. I'll grab you. You're another human. Do we backdoor some mages? I mean, Lena's not really great. I think I'm gonna put you back in. Because you are a three star. I mean, it's not like we're making any synergy changes. Not interested. I mean, I guess I'll go ahead and grab the Lena. We can happen to two star it. I don't know. Okay, thank you for not actually be hitting the Lycan. You can hit the Omni. He's tough enough. He's going to be okay. But we don't want to delay. Oh! Oh, shit. He was just in the middle of his casting animation. Looks like we're going to win anyway. That was close. Um, you've got a ring of regen. We'll give it to another frontliner. I don't know. Just because it's something. The only thing you make is a Hooded Vines, right? Yeah. And we're short both other items required to make it. Uh, maybe someone's got the, the robe or whatever. Cloak. Cloak, I guess. Robe is the negative magic resist. None of these are part of what we're looking for. Um, We're still winning. I'm going to do a reroll here. You're very interesting. And then there's a possibility of some beast stuff. Okay, well hold on for now, because we can we can re-roll some stuff. Um ring ring shield. Whatever, I'll give it to you. I'm sure we'll end up like selling and moving these guys around a whole bunch. We might end up going for a really early eight here. Okay, so Mask Oof does have some assassins. Did kill my Veno early, which is, uh, he, he didn't even put down a single play ward, which is very disappointing. We are going to be okay, though. Alright, we things were looking really bad at first, but we got a half-decent comp going on. We don't really need this Chaos Knight or this Abaddon, because getting to the three star is pretty rough. I mean, Puck could set us up for future dragon stuff, but like that's like so, so crazy to think about. I think I will sell you two, and I'm gonna pick up the pair of Wind Rangers. And that's that. All right, we are wind streaking hard. 
might have been nice to do some sort of buy or something just to try to encourage like more more better win streaking. You're about to get exploded for some damage here. But yeah, not too bad. Plague Ward goes down. So we got some AoE effectively from Luna. That's pretty much it. Everything else we've got a single target. So we're definitely going to be looking for some AoE. Um, I mean, we'll, 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 we'll kind of get some when we get up to... Um, oh, I, I want to see... I want to see what this guy looks like when he's flying. Uh, he just looks exactly the same, but bigger. Yeah, no, he's no fun. Lone Druid, pretty good. And a fourth beast possibility. Uh, we can level up. Next turn's more optimal. I'm going to reroll here. Probably sell you as well. I could have just leveled up. Actually, with the win streak bonus, I really should have. I'm like, but no, 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 it's too early, but it doesn't matter. I mean, I'm still probably going to want to get the 9 on this game anyway. That yeah, was a mistake. If I lose my win streak here, that's actually huge. It looks like we're going to be fine. But yeah, I definitely should have gone ahead with the level up. Anyway, I'll spend, uh, I'll spend now. I mean, I still had more money. Like, I could have just done it. Uh, he, okay, no, there we go. He does fly. I guess he hasn't triggered for the change. But I don't like the little hoppy hop that he does. Um, I mean, maybe, you're a human, so that's something. to go ham with the rerolls on this round, but, uh, I mean, the thing is, like, giving you a Staff of Wizardry doesn't really do anything, because you're not, you're often not targeting whatever, you know, you're hitting. Javelin, that's going to go on Luna. Part of the problem is I don't know what we're looking for right now. We got the well, we're looking for the Naga and a lone druid. We're sort of looking for purples at this point. I don't think I can change couriers a second time. No. You change couriers once per game. Yeah, I don't like them. I like the trusty yak better. Selling CMs, I don't know, like, we could have gone to four, four humans. Well, I prefer it being a DK. Like, if we get four human, four beast, four knight synergy somehow all going on, that's pretty sexy. All right. And somewhere in there, a Medusa. Because Medusa. I'm going to pull you out, because we don't have the beast synergy. I think we actually corner more. I just didn't have enough time to manipulate things here. We'll grab the Veno. Level, level, one more. So there's a good natural level up in two rounds. Getting Kunkka there certainly hurts a lot. There we go. We get you going on. We get some items on Medusa so that she can get off her ult a little faster. It'd be nice. You can actually, um, I, I, I gotta remember, frontlining Medusa actually makes a little bit of sense here. Um, and that's probably what you do. Look at this, four wards. I tell you, Venomancer with that ability is so nice. Okay. Um, we, we need to do some buying, but we also need to do some moving around here. Um... 
actually, hold on. Something a little like that. Turn. What dreams are dead? We don't need more physical damage from the Warlord. Stolen form is a go. I don't know why he's so far back fighting the assassins. I wasn't actually watching the flow of the battle. All right, win streak continues to go, which is nice. Doing well here. Level nine's hitting. We can put the uh, we can put the enchantress back in. Sort of waiting for a second lone druid. Oh, there we go. See, I say maybe the four B synergy is worth it, even without this. But oh get in and then you sort of have to like move one to like cause it to re-trigger okay that's four beasts who do we pull back here um i think we pull you back put you here put you there we'll trigger fairly quickly um no uh, we already got the two star medusa the Kunkka would be pretty excellent, though. We probably sell some of the shit that we're not really working on. Um, we have two humans. That's probably going to be... Well, Kunkka's going to be a human. If we could get DK, that would be a human. Like, we might... Four, four human synergy might be in the cards. And it's so good, but really... Four beast, four knight. Go into town on that. And then we sort of just want higher tier dudes. Um... I wonder if we just go up to level 10 and then start replacing things with uh, higher tier stuff. We'd probably sell her and replace, like, put in Kanka. We might be able to finish Lycan, though. And Lycan fills both the human and the beast role, which is really nice. He's not a knight. Probably the Luna. Because we're not going to be as likely to see many of her, the two pieces. I mean, it's still 30% chance to see two pieces. I forget how consistent they are. Twos and the threes. I guess everything stays at a fairly even. Uh, cloak, ring of health. Still not a ring of regen, for crying out loud. I have to wait until, what, like, troll round with, like, 17,000 trolls, and hopefully start getting some, some ring of health in there. Um, okay, that's interesting that we get two Kunkas in the list here. Time to shove off. Um, we obviously have to play you. Um, break knights? Break beasts. Oh wait, that's a ring of health. Hold the phone. Give it to you. I don't know if that was the right pick, but I was like, no, get it on someone quick. Probably want to get more items, but... Yeah, we're, we're going to hit a very, very early level 10 and probably just win this. I mean, we've got so much health. The thing is, it really depends on what other people do. Uh, he's level 9. Has he gone all in? No, he's got tons of money too. Um, I don't think we're building another Omni or anything like that. I hear Tidehunter is pretty good. Uh, this would give us Naga as well. Um... Who would pull back out of here? Yeah, so now we go down to Knight 2, which I think is fine. 
we might want to keep Abba around just because we might want Undead Synergy if we get a Lich or Necro or some damn thing. Uh, I can hit the level up button twice next turn and go up to 10. Um, I should really sell the, uh, the Lena. I don't think there's any room for that. Because we're just going to be putting in, like, uh, tier 5 dudes now. Um, since we did lose the CK, we could play with Doom. Make sure Kunkka survives. You still don't have a real source of magic damage. <clears throat> I got some assassin moves in the back. Uh, wow. Okay, that was fairly explosive in the rear. I think we need to corner strat against Mask here. Hopefully we can keep our win combo going. Dooming the TA means nothing, but we are going to win. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to move a little more into the corner or something. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep the line strat. I'm not going to go corner strat, but it'll be the rearmost line we can do. So if the assassins jump in, they're going to get hit by our melee dudes. Um, okay, there's a bunch of stuff here. Let me... Do a little something like this. Um, okay, sell you, grab you, reroll again. Oops, I don't know who's going to get put back. That's okay. Um, there's a DK. Let me get the second Naga, get this... Okay, actually, I don't think Lycan 3s so much in the future. I don't know. We gotta clear some room on the board here. It's a lot of regen. Ooh, another big explosion. Uh, there goes our, our win streak. Alright, only one guy left. Tend to lose one-on-one. -on -one. People are better at countering my shit than than anything. Um, but yeah, we start some hard rerolls. Um, for you. We just gotta go for, like, big AoEs. Super high-quality dudes. Fucking AoE on this shit, man. I need it to reposition. Yeah, he's gonna win. I am not. Like, at all. Oh fuck, without, um, without another druid. Well, I guess I will go and make the second one the hard way for now. It's gonna have to be okay. Um, Both of our Nagas go at the same time. I think so. Ah, uh, don't ulti there! We need to kunk over here! I 
You know what? The Dragon Knight doesn't even have room in our comp. Does he? Sell the Luna. We really need burst against these guys. To counter the region. I mean, breaking my synergies left and right. Oh shit, that is really bad. to do. My late game is so poor. He's level 9 and not all in. I'm level 10 and all in. boat better boat okay and another boat for good measure and another one I gotta say two two star kunkas might be better than one three star kunka <laughs> oh my god another boat okay we both won though Words do a fair bit. Time to show We've got so much CC. I mean, we're gonna win our board, it looks like, but he's gonna win his, like. Are we gonna win our board? Yes. No. Wow. That mech synergy, man. Something the something the bear was probably dumb, right? Certainly dumb against this round. Man, we could have used some items. 
he's gonna win over there. Yeah. Um. Maybe breaking my synergies has killed us. against the assassins. Maybe we'll put doom, both dooms in the back. We've almost got a doom three though. The point where like, do I sell aggressively to get the doom three? We really need to boat the assassins. There is a boat on the assassins. Number three with a fuck ton of items. Jesus. Okay. Well, we are going to lose. earlier. Oh, we're so close to leveling up everyone over here. I'm leery to sell anyone. Okay, he's level 10. He still has an economy too, though. Uh, sell her, give the item to Gyro. Probably. Fuck, we might just be dead here. 20 hit points. Oh. oh. We are not actually that close to the next level of him. I'm gonna sell Luna. And give the items there, and then and then what? Actually, I'm not sure. <sighs> Why am I so bad at late game? Well, because you don't you don't get to the extreme late game that often, so practicing it is hard. Wait. Okay, I was gonna say, my board's not looking too bad. Maybe I can not die. Apparently I crushed his board. Must have just gotten lucky with the right ulties. Uh, I wish I'd been looking at what the hell was going on over here. <laughs> Wait. Uh, thanks for watching, folks. Clearly, that was 100% all skill. Um, Well-deserved win by me. I outplayed the guy in the end, obviously. Uh, no one can argue that. See you next time. Bye-bye.